In this video, we're going to add sound effects so that every time the ball hits one of the boundary walls or the paddle, it makes a noise. It's actually pretty quick and simple to do. We're going to come here and click on our ball, choose edit, and then go back into behaviors. So if you remember in the last video, we coded the velocity of the ball. We're going to go ahead again and just add a sound effect this time. The trigger that we need is collision because we are going to enforce the sound effect when the ball collides with an object such as the wall or paddle. So select collision. I can bring the node and drag it down here. And then we're going to add sound effect, which is found in the components menu. And then you literally just connect hit to play. And if you click sound effect, you get a lot of different sounds. You can come down here and see all the different sound effects. I'm just going to select this one here, and you can change the volume if you'd like. You can also loop the sound if needed, or if you have MP3, you can have the URL for that MP3. You can put that link in here too to get different sounds, so that's pretty cool. Click OK, and then click Play. And now, every time the ball hits the wall, we have our sound effect. I'm going to go ahead and stop playing the game and exit out. Click OK. And that's all you need to do to add some sound effects to your game. Up next, we're going to talk about how to make the ball move even faster over time. See you in the next video.